Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. So, I see you're interested in learning Python. Or perhaps you heard of it and you want to find out more about it. For starters, Python is definitely one of the most used and most efficient languages of this rapidly growing technological era. And you will understand why as you learn this language and if you compare it to other languages such as C, C++ or Java. I could talk about Python all day if I wanted to. But for now, without any further delay, let's kick off. So first off, I would need you to download Python on your computer. This can be done from the official Python website. And here, the latest version of Python is 3.8.2 that I already have installed on my computer. You can get this also for Linux, Mac and other operating systems as well. Now, once the file is downloaded and you open it, the Python installer will guide you on the installation process. The next step is to get an IDE, an Integrated Development Environment. Python would help you code, but to view the results and if you want to modify your code while viewing the results, you would need an IDE. There are several IDEs that you can find across multiple platforms. But I would suggest using Wing Personal as that is what I use and it would be easier to refer to. You could also use the online IDE replit in which you can also code other languages easily without the help of any pre-installed application. As for the Wing Personal IDE, you can search it up on Google to download it. And uh, as you can see here after searching it up, it says the latest version is 7.2.1. And once I open that, here you can see that it's available also for other operating systems and also for other processors. And uh, here I would have to get Windows installer because mine is a Windows laptop and it is a 64-bit. Similarly, you can also choose what is suitable for you. And once you're done downloading it, you can open the file and the installer of the application will instruct you on how to install it. So, now that you're done with the setup, you can open your Wing Personal IDE and as this is the first time that you'll be coding Python, I don't want to overwhelm you with information, so I'll give the very basics before we can start off fully fledged. This is how it looks after you've opened Wing Personal. You can open a new project from here. The first and foremost thing that we'll learn in Python is the print function. Whatever you want to show the user by printing can be inputted to the computer using this function in this way. While starting any language, the first print command usually used is this. Hello world. For now, you can just type in exactly what I typed and I'll explain the purpose of the things later. And once you've typed that, you can click play there. And then you can click OK on this box. And after that, you can save your files from here. And now it should uh, give you your output, which over here is hello world. You could as well type your name like this. and that should give you your name. Thanks a lot for watching my video. Please like, subscribe and share. You could always leave comments for me to make my next video better and to give you a better experience. Thank you.